Hey guys, welcome to ASP.NET MVC5 with Entity Framework course. My name is Ripon Dutto. In this course, I will be covering this list of topics. First of all, introduction about the MVC and advantages. Your first ASP.NET MVC application, then model view controller, then I will be showing you three a process entity framework code first entity framework model first then entity framework database first after that I will be showing you data annotations which is one of the most important part of ASP.NET MVC then lambda expressions link with ASP.NET MVC finally I will be showing you how to create your product management application demo which is a demo project I mean in this project I will be applying crude operations create read update and delete operations which are the basic operations of an application all right so let's get started with the introduction advantages of an MVC based web application well MVC based web application is easy to manage complexity by dividing an application into several parts for example model view and controller and it does not use view state or server based forms so this makes the MVC framework ideal for developers who want full control over the behavior of an application okay separation of concerns means MVC application divides its input logic business logic and UI logic separately which is more testable and maintainable TDD test driven development MVC framework provides better support for test driven development and it is extensible and pluggable that means the components of the ASP.NET framework are designed so that they can be easily replaced or customized. You can plug in your own view engine, URL routing policy, action method, parameter serialization, etc. ASP.NET MVC framework also supports the use of dependency injection and inversion of control container that means IOC container. DI that means dependency injection enables you to inject objects into class instead of relying on the class to create the object itself alright so ASP.NET MVC has a lot of advantages and you know now it is it is one of the most popular framework in the world this is the introductory class in the next lesson, I will be showing you how to create your first ASP.NET MVC application. Okay, so stay well and keep in touch. Thank you.